And there you go. You already have your program right there and you can proceed. Hi guys, what's up? Welcome to my vlog. It's Tutor Ko right here, your online common sense tutor. At nagbabalik po tayo guys para sa isang video na mostly requested sa channel natin. Ito yung pag -re reset ng isang printer ng Epson. At specifically guys, ito po yung uh, Epson L3110. Wow! Okay, so yung point natin dito guys kasi sa lahat ng mga printers resetting uh, procedures na na-undergo ko or na-experience, ito yung uh, Epson L3110 yung pinaka mas mahirap sa lahat oh, kasi no. nga meron ka pang uh, gagawing mga modification sa settings ng yung computer kasi hindi siya basta-basta nagra-run. Kasi meron tayong tinatawag na mga antivirus sa computer natin na nagdi-detect ng part ng resetter na to ng Epson L3110 na kung saan kapag hindi natin na-disable yung uh, antivirus natin or anti-malware natin sa ating computer ay hindi talaga magra-run yung resetter na ito. Oh, no. So guys, i-explain natin kung bakit kailangan muna natin i-temporary disable yung mga antivirus natin sa ating computer upang mabigyang daan yung pag-run ng resetter na ito. So una guys, kasi nga, I-disable natin temporarily yung ating mga um, antivirus sa computer natin. Kaya kinakailangan guys muna na disconnect muna yung ating computer sa internet. Kasi ang mayayari kapag nakakonect siya sa internet tapos na-disable mo, ang iyong uh, antivirus, malamang maraming mga viruses ang pupunta sa computer mo. Oh, no. Para maging safe siya guys, at least safe siya, kasi hindi naman natin kailangan na buong araw yung resetting. Uh, in a matter of uh, a few minutes, a couple of minutes, marireset na yung printer mo. Wow. So, uh, temporarily disable all your antivirus software in your computer para makapag-start tayo mag-reset ng printer natin. Okay? So, yun, yun yung gagawin natin bago natin marun yung um, software resetter natin. So, ipapakita ko guys dito sa screenshot na to, screen recording, kung papano gawin at mapagana yung ating Epson L3110 printer resetter. Tsaka nga pala guys, yung download link niyan ng ating uh, resetter ay makikita sa comments below sa video na ito. Pakiclick na lang at uh, nakalagay rin dyan kung may password o wala yung ating uh, printer resetter guys. So, disclaimer lang po tayo, wala pong 100% na, um, na sabihin natin assurance na gagana talaga yung resetter na ito sa inyong computer. Kasi nga, bawat computer natin ay may iba't ibang design. Iba-iba yung mga CPU niyan guys. So, meron tayong mga vendors ng Intel, merong AMD. So, kung magkataon na yung resetter na to after na na-disable mo na yung uh, antivirus mo, eh hindi pa rin siya magraran. So, posibleng uh, i-recommend -re kong humanap ka kayo ng ibang resetter. Kasi nga, meron tayong tinatawag na compatibility issues when it comes to running of programs. Oh, no. Okay guys? So, paalala lang po, huwag na huwag kalimutang ibalik ang pag-activate ng inyong antivirus after resetting your printer. Okay? So, sa procedure kung paano mapagana natin yung ating um, resetter ng printer, ito na siya guys. And before yan, no, papasalamatan ko muna yung mga subscribers natin at saka yung mga nagko-comment sa ating channel kasi um, dyan ko makikita guys na um, merong halaga yung mga videos na ginagawa natin. At maraming salamat sa inyong pagsasubscribe at pag sa channel natin. At kung bago ka pala sa channel ko, huwag nang mag-atubiling mag-alinlangan pa. Subscribe na and click the notification bell. Okay guys, so much na yung introduction ko para sa resetting ng printer na ito. So let's go! Alright guys, kapag na-download na yung Epson resetter natin, Okay, so by the way guys, I need to use English language at this moment because we also do have subscribers from other countries. So what we're going to do is that we need to uh, disconnect first our computer from the internet. So if you are connected via Wi-Fi, just click this icon and turn your uh, Wi-Fi off as of the moment. And if you are connected via LAN cable, just disconnect it physically so that you will not have any access to external network. So what we're going to do now at this point is that 
we need to disable our uh, antivirus temporarily as in my case I have my smart of smart antivirus so what I'm going to do is to open this task manager and temporarily disable my smart app or smart AV okay so I just ended it through this uh, task manager and now we can start so this one just double click this one and then we're going to extract this um, the contents of this folder in this uh, desktop so what we're going to do is to create new folder right here for us to easily identify where our resetter files are saved so as in this case we will uh, name this folder as resetter l3110 epson okay so you can name the folder whatever you want so at this point now we can drag this folder from this archive files or um, uh, file from the um, from this folder so that is a zip file so drag it directly inside this one and you will be asked for a password so just kindly enter the password that you can see there on the description or you can just copy this one so by the way guys this software is not mine I just borrowed this from another youtuber so uh, he owns all the um, rights regarding this software that we have here we are just only um, teaching how to use this printer resetter okay at this point what we're going to do is to open this one and we need first to go to keygen folder and let's create a license so this file at this moment we need to run this one so just click run as administrator click yes and here we go just let's just wait for it to uh, pop up okay and uh, we will be creating a license so you can see this one right now here so just click license manager and then what we're going to do is to add license for our um, resetter so as in this case we will use Tio as the name Turco or anything that you would like to name it so uh, the hardware ID is also found in the description just kindly locate that one just copy it and paste it on the hardware ID and just click save right once that is saved then you need to click create license key so that the files will be generated all right so it's been successfully generated just click OK and as of this moment let's proceed to the folder where we save the uh, Epson resetter and uh, we need to copy first the uh, files from the generated um, folder right here just highlight all those files okay so right click and click copy then go back to Epson L3110 resetter just go on in this folder and right click replace all the files in the destination okay so right after that there's a possibility that our uh, Windows Defender will stop this just uh, allow this program for a short while so right click run as administrator click yes and uh, there you go this been registered to Tuturco and there you go you already have your program right there and you can proceed to reset your printer just click select all right and uh, the same principle applies with the other resetters that we have I will show it in a short video after this okay so let's continue these are the error lights okay at this point just follow the prompt select your printer and click OK and go to particular adjustment mode and select waste ink pad counter click OK and let's check the current status of the counter by checking this checkbox and click check you can see it's already 100% and it needs resetting check these two check boxes that we have on this window and click on initialize to start resetting your printer all right just click OK Okay, so once done, turn off your printer and just turn it back on to complete the process. And that's it. 
At yun na nga guys, yung mga simple steps natin kung paano mapapatakbo yung resetter ng ating Epson L3110. At sana guys, nakatulong yung video ito na ma-reset yung mga printers nyo, especially yung mga teachers natin dyan, mga co-teachers natin na namum problema kasi nahihirapan sila mag-reset ng kanilang mga printers. So uh, maraming salamat sa support guys at see you in my next vlogs. And uh, God bless everyone, it's Tutor Ko right here again. It's your online common sense tutor always saying, keep safe and have a great day.